y'all. How you doing? Renee here. If you are returning, welcome back. If you're new, hey there. Uh, we do mobile home living content, mom life, clean motivation, lifestyle. Uh, currently in this video, it's the start of the long list of DIYs and uh, I guess it could be home renovations or remodeling that we are going to be doing to our kitchen and living room and some other parts of our older mobile home that we live in. Um, so in this video, I guess it could just be a part one of me starting the remodel of our kitchen. I'll be painting kitchen cabinets and things like that. Uh, there will not be a video on Friday, so I'll see y'all on Monday with a part two. Or maybe not a part two, but you'll see how it all turned out after I worked on it this weekend. So yeah, thanks for joining us. If you're you know, interested in this type of thing, go ahead and give the video a thumbs up. Um, if you want to check out the rest of my channel, see if you like any of the things that I do, um, go ahead, check it out, maybe subscribe, you know, we'd love to have you join our growing community. Uh, so yeah, let's get back into the video as I prep everything for painting and then I'll start painting. And after re-listening to my intro, I realized I was using my customer service voice. Um, what is my customer service voice, you may ask? It is my voice that I use when I'm at work or I'm dealing with the public or I get nervous. Um, I'll admit sometimes doing these voiceovers, I get nervous. I don't know why, you know, but I do. So either work related, public related, or because I'm nervous, my customer service voice comes into play. It's something that sometimes I can turn off and sometimes I can't. So, is what it is. It'll be all right. Let's roll with it. You should call the police. No, I even can breathe. You love me and hate me, true me and false me. Make me your shining star. Giving, receiving, changing, believing, holding them with a star. Feel like, feel like. I just put down a cheap white sheet that I had used sometimes for vendor events for my vinyl business but we're currently not doing vendor events right now so it's not being used and I didn't want paint on my carpet so I turned it into a paint drop sheet Standing still as I let go of your cold hand Eyes are wet, the lips are dry And all the things we'd planned Were never what you wanted We've been lying from the start Guess I knew it, just ignored it I let go of your cold hand I guess I saw it coming Yet it took me by surprise Oh, oh But if there's nothing left then I will just crack a smile Oh, oh I had a million different things to do And every one of them included you We had a million different things to do Why can't I say well I've been lonely too
on the sheets are covered in your scent Really tried to fall asleep but I can't understand Though we both felt kinda lonely I still always thought you loved me When I tried to let it go The sheets are covered in your scent I guess I saw it coming yet And here, Manny hands me a hammer And I start hammering down staples that I've already painted over After peeling up strips so this is a perfect example of I'm impatient. So I just kind of keep the ball rolling and then backtrack and then have to roll back over it again. So welcome to part of my personality that you may not have known about. <laughs> Guess I knew it, just ignored it I let go of your cold hand And because I suck at laundry, I didn't have any clean washcloths to or clean rags to wipe down the cabinets and the drawers and things like that. So I just used what I had on hand, which was the Great Value uh, disinfectant wipes. So it, you know, it's not what I wanted, but it'll be all right. It'll get the job done. You know, another mark of me not being prepared for something. <laughs>
these days, I do need to go through this configured Tupperware cabinet because it's a hot mess. Um, there's lids without boxes, there's boxes without lids. Um, it's all just thrown in there, so I gotta go through it, declutter, keep the good stuff, pitch the bad stuff, because this is crazy. Are y'all seeing what I'm seeing? This is bad.
Well, maybe you know this in the little laughing, smiley face at the top right hand corner. Um, Emmanuel kept walking in and out of frame without a shirt on, and he didn't feel comfortable being shown without a shirt on. So I told him I would edit him out. Well, I didn't really edit him out. I just covered him up. So that's why you're seeing the laughing, smiley face emoji up there. So I did my job and just covered him up so he wouldn't feel uncomfortable. Y'all, it is Tuesday morning. <coughs> Excuse me. Alright, so it is Tuesday morning. I am getting coffee. I'm catching up on YouTube because I haven't watched it in like a week. Um, for those who I do watch, I apologize. I'm catching up on your videos. But anyway, so I come into the kitchen to get some, like, my, I don't know, my second cup of coffee. And this little bugger, for whatever reason, no matter how many toys I pick up, and he gets thrown in a box, he will usually end up in this area of the kitchen. I step on him, I trip on him, his little tail and feet hurt my toes, like, uh, just because they're pokey. But me and this dinosaur are about to have some issues, we're about to get into a fight. I don't know, but I'm not liking it, you know, folks say that uh, stepping on Legos is bad. Well, I'm tired of stepping on this conflagrant dinosaur. So. Watch out for dinosaurs if you're ever in my house. Alright, so I got 
All right, so I got the second coat on that one. I need to do a second coat on that bottom part. Um, not doing that because that's going to be ripped out. But the other side of this cabinet and part of that cabinet, as you can see, is white there. Um, I started a first coat here and need to work it all the way down. Um, and you still need to paint the drawers that go here and all of the doors. And I know that was white already, but I'm going to throw on a second coat, or not a second coat, but a coat anyway, just to touch it up because it was looking really dingy. Um, this I'm not painting because this is going to come out. Um, I think maybe it, it was supposed to be like a little desk just by how it's shaped. Um, I'm going to have Manny or I may go into demo mode and pull it out, but um, I've actually got a microwave cart that's going to go right here. So, just got to finish up all this first coat, let it dry, second coat, drawers, doors, yeah, so it's coming along pretty good. Let me bring y'all around the other side right quick. Hi, Emma. So, you can't see it. So, it's coming along really good. And like I said, this top half is going to come out because I, I don't like it. So, I'll update y'all after a while. Alright, so I'm going to call it a night with the painting. Um, I'm cooking supper right now. I've got some kielbasa and potato. And I don't have onion, so I got onion powder in there um, going. Uh, but I've also got tonight, um, I need to finish up uh, the order for uh, the farmer's market vendor that I do. I gotta finish up his order to deliver it to him tomorrow morning. Yeah. Um, it's that much. I just have to finish it. Uh, so, it, that's it for the painting tonight. Um, you know, I have some more work to do and I'll show you that in a minute. Um, but let's see, tomorrow's Wednesday. So I'm off Wednesday, Thursday, no, I'm sorry, I'm working Wednesday, Thursday, Friday of this week, and then I'm off Saturday and Sunday. So I'll be able to get these done Saturday and Sunday, uh, get them finished, and uh, I'll be able to show y'all the after, or the complete project um, of that. So it'll be Monday's video, probably. Um, so yeah, I'm going to call it an evening, well, for painting. Um, as usual, if there are any prayer requests you have, you can message me on Instagram or leave them down below in the comments. And, uh, yeah, I pray y'all are having a good week, and I'll see you later. Here's the current, you know, where we're at currently with the painting. I do want to let y'all know that due to my work schedule this week, there won't be a video on Friday. But there will be one on Monday, so I will see y'all Monday. Have a great weekend.